Hey everybody, it's me, Adri, with Raising Batman. I know it's uh, been a long time since I made a video. Um, there's been a lot going on at my house lately, uh, especially with all of this quarantine and school shutting down. Um, but it is World Autism Awareness Day, and I thought today would be good day as any to check in with everybody, see how all y'all are doing. I'm so sorry I haven't posted anything in a while. Um, before all this started, I was having a lot of problems with Gage and his insurance and going back and forth with it and getting his services off and on. Um, so that was a lot to go through and now with the uh, quarantine, um, everything's canceled. I'm trying to do what everybody else is doing and keep up with working from home and homeschooling and I'm losing the battle of keeping the house from getting completely destroyed. I can't keep up with how fast they're destroying the house versus how fast I can clean it. I've kind of just given up. Um, the uh, All of his therapies are closed. All of his, you know, the school obviously is closed. And I don't know about y'all's kids, but my son thrives and craves routine and it's not the same at home. I can do all the speech and OT and school at home, but it's not the same. He wants to go there. He's extremely frustrated. Um, he asks about it constantly and he knows when we have breaks in school and it's like warmer outside summertime, we usually go to family's houses. So not only is he asking about his baseball and bowling and school and ABA and speech and OT and all that, he's now wanting to go to family's house, which we can't do that either. I don't know how it is where y'all are, but I'm in Texas, in Dallas County, and we're not allowed to go out unless it's for food or you're an essential employee, which my husband is. He works um, in the food industry, so he is gone a lot. Um, still working so and it um, I've kind of been sad that um, I've had to kind of step back from raising Batman because it really means a lot to me and everybody that follows the page and messaged me and stuff um, you guys mean a lot and um, my boutique has picked up a lot and gotten really busy which is great um, I'm thankful for that <clears throat> but um, I don't have any time for anything anymore. Any, any free time that I did have, <laughs> my free time, um, there's not enough hours in the day. There's just really not. So, um, but I, I wanted to kind of check in while, um, my kids are quiet for five seconds. I don't even think they're quiet. I, they're inside in the playroom playing while I'm sitting outside to try to get some peace and quiet because they're either constantly fighting or running around and playing and screaming which that is one thing I am um, happy about that now that they've got to spend so much time together they've found a way to play together for the first time which is really cool um, I mean, I'm not going to sugarcoat anything, obviously. It's it's not going very well over here at my house, which I'm assuming is probably the same case with all of you. Um, but there, there is that. Um, Harley has always craved Gage's attention a lot, and she is now completely up his butt the entire time, so it gets on his nerves. But the way they have found to play together is Gage likes to script a lot. That's one of vocal stimming, like big time. And Harley watches the same videos and, and stuff that Gage does. So she has figured out that if she kind of does what he does and repeats some of the shows or videos that he watches, that he'll interact with her. So now that's what they do, is they act out these videos and they script together and 
that's how they play together, which I think it's cute. I think they've, you know, they're they're laughing and playing, and then, you know, of course, with any kids, it, it turns into fighting soon after, but at least there's that. At least they've found that. So, um, I hope everybody is okay. Um, check on your friends. Check on check on the people with, you know, your autism households and with multiple kids in the house or hell, even with one kid in the house, it's this homeschooling stuff and everything is, you know, not easy and trying to, trying to work from home and it's, like I said, there's not enough hours in the day, but I wanted to check on everybody and let me know how things are going. Still feel free to message me. I constantly have my phone attached to me because my phone is always blowing up and getting messages and whatnot. Um, feel free to still ask me questions and things like that. Don't hesitate. It's just, I just don't have the time as far as posting and everything like that goes. I have a ton of resources saved um, in my phone for all, all of this quarantine stuff going on, all these free resources out there that I will try to get posted. But um, thanks everybody. Bye.